One of our viewers asked in the comment section below, how can I develop my energetic body? This is an important question. A question, in fact, so important, it could cause a revolution in consciousness. The powers of the energetic body are many. Tonight, we'll explore an essential aspect of this question together, the solar life force that powers our energetic nature. I'm Golden Dawn Imperator David Griffin, and this is Magic 101. <laughs> We live in a world dominated by material values, from nurturing our physical bodies at our mother's breast to the subtle materialism sold to us with modern advertising. Material values permeate every aspect of our culture. I'm not condemning materialism. I enjoy prosperity and success as much as anyone else. It's when we get our out of balance that problems arise, and there's a serious imbalance prevalent in our culture because we were never taught to feed our energetic bodies with solar life force. In the Hermetic tradition, we call this vital energy lux, spelled LVX. This stellar lux energy shines across the universe and permeates everything. Here on Earth, we live in a vast field of electromagnetic solar energy. Hermetic science uses magic and alchemy to teach us how to assimilate and shine ever-increasing amounts of lux energy. In reality, hermetic magic and alchemy are ancient technologies for energetic soul growth. Hermetic philosophy teaches that every human being has a divine spark within. This divine spark is an embryonic energetic seed that, when properly nourished, can grow into an energetic body, a pure starfire, the hermetic tradition calls a solar body of light. According to hermetic lore, this solar body of light can be used as a vehicle by human beings, even to survive physical death with our consciousness fully intact. In ancient Egyptian lore, this immortal solar body was symbolized by the bark of Ra or the solar bow. Hermeticism is not alone in speaking of an immortal solar body of light. Tibetan Buddhism, for example, speaks of an immortal rainbow body. All the great initiatic traditions, east and west, speak of the energy that Hermetic Masters call Lux. Yoga and Tantra call this energy Kundalini. Taoist Masters call it Chi. Esoteric Christianity calls this energy life and suggests it is what Jesus Christ referred to when he spoke of abundant life. Mundane science only recently learned to harness the power of solar energy in order to create electricity. For this to happen, the requisite technology had first to be developed. Along the same lines, Hermeticism, using the methods of magic and alchemy, has for millennia discreetly provided the technology we need to ignite and nurture our solar bodies. Every woman and every man is a star. One characteristic of our solar bodies is that, as they mature, they develop the ability to shine. In other words, to radiate solar light force. But gravity has bound our consciousness into a dark and narrow place, a place wherein the material dimension we experience on this planet, we perceive is the only one that exists. As our solar bodies mature, however, we also gain the ability to remain conscious in the higher dimensions that in magic we call the inner planes. From the time I was a boy, growing up by the San Francisco Bay, I sensed a deep spiritual longing and a deep spiritual passion. It was while serving in the United States Army during intense physical exercise, that one day I accidentally discovered the Luke's energy for the first time. It came spontaneously. It felt like a wave of champagne bubbles washing across me. With time, I began to have these waves of energy come more regularly. It became my life's passion to learn to control this energy and to learn to give it by shining it at will. In my quest, I studied transpersonal psychology I became involved in the human potential movement. But it was not until I discovered hermetic magic, the hermetic magic of the golden dawn, that I truly learned to master this Luke's energy and to summon it and direct it and will. One benefit of the development of my solar body with hermetic magic has brought to me is vibrant health. 
I'm so full of vital life force these days that I rarely, if ever, even catch cold any longer. At times, when viruses flatten others around me for days, I nearly always remain unaffected. Magic has also improved my relationships. I've developed loving patience and understanding, together with ever-increasing emotional balance and equilibrium. Finally, a healthy and radiant solar body of light has paradoxically brought me success and prosperity also at the mundane financial level. The well-beingness that comes with an abundance of life force has seeped through to all levels of my life. Getting started with magic can be simple when you know what steps to take. That's why I've prepared a special free report just for you. It's called 10 Magic Spells That Work Every Time. And it walks you through 10 secret magic spells that will help you manifest things like more money, a better love life, better health, and more. Each spell is laid out in simple step-by-step -step detail, so you can put them to use and get results right away. It's the fastest, easiest, and most effective way to put magic to work in your life, starting today. To claim your free copy, 10 Magic Spells That Work Every Time, go to magicthatworks.com. That's magic with a K, thatworks.com, right now. Or just click the link button. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.